Hey, what's going on guys? Seraphiki here, and on Borderlands 2, there's actually an easter egg that allows you to get sort of like a Minecraft skin head sort of thing for your character. You can actually get it for, I'm pretty sure, every single character you can choose, which is like four. The Siren, Commando, Gunzerker, and the Assassin. So at the moment I'm just playing as the Assassin, and I'm just going to quickly show you how to do it. So basically, you have to be up to Chapter 9, I think the point where the city... Uh, sanctuary has just flown off into the sky and teleported away. And if you go to re-enter the city again, you'll be put into this place called Sanctuary Hole. And you'll actually notice that there's a massive hole just, yeah, where the city was, basically. So, what you want to do is just sort of make your way around here. And uh, I'd recommend you be at least level 19 or 20. You can be lower than that. I've seen people at, like, like level 14 do it. So, it's not like a requirement to be a specific level, it's just whether you're up to the point or not, and whether you want to actually go through this section, because it's quite difficult the lower level you are. So, just around here, is, if you, if you jump over here, if, you've got to be careful though, just look on the mini-map and make sure you're sort of lined up with the arrow. You can sort of see that there's a travel point, so if you just slide down here, you can jump straight onto this. And there we go, Caustic Caverns. This is actually like a corrosion-based area, so the the glowing green liquid in the ground is like acid, and it melts away your armor. So I wouldn't suggest you going near that sort of stuff. So you, you can refill your ammo if you really need to. Actually, I might do that now. Welcome, in case there's any uh, monsters or any of that sort of stuff. Random, random things just seem to go at you. Just turn this. I turn it. I'll do that again. Right. -o. So just out here is. So the idea of this, you can go any way you want, but I'll quickly, I'll just sort of show you the easy way. Probably not a good thing. I'm using a corrosion weapon against corrosion-based enemies, but whatever. <laughs> I'm just going to sort of avoid the enemies here, just to make this quicker. So you can just run straight through. Being the assassin is quite handy because you can just deploy your invisibility and run for five seconds and try and get away. And if you've got the uh, the shock uh, unlock thing for it, where when you turn back visible your decoy explodes, that can be quite handy too. Or the uh, the happy, happy, happy one where you can just keep knifing or stabbing them or whatever you want to call it and you can just keep staying invisible, that's pretty handy too. So basically, you want to sort of keep to the right because generally the the most of the monsters and the enemies and all that sort of stuff are trying to follow you so as long as you just keep running you can fight them if you want, it just takes a little bit longer. So basically, as you can see, I'm just sort of running away that I'll just quickly show you. If you look at my armor, it disintegrates my armor. But, um, yeah, you don't generally want to be in that sort of stuff. So, just around here. And, uh, going around the outside of the, the edge of the area to the right side, it's probably one of the safest ways to do it because if you go straight down the center, there's a lot more enemies there. Like, there's just so many, and it's pretty crazy. So when you make your way just down here, you want to keep to the right once again. And just down there, if you can sort of see, there's some rocks that you can sort of make your way across. You can loot that chest if you want. It's up to you. Just over here. See this square block? Just jump on it. And uh, so we'll just come down here, around here. And as you can see, there is actually some Minecraft textured blocks and uh, just sort of hit them the way you would just like sort of melee attack so I'm gonna switch to my handgun and uh, yeah so there we go just uh, you know the usual Minecraft things it'd be cool if you could actually get like the ores and stuff out of the rocks I think I just got some ammo out of the coal and uh, a creeper so you just gotta be careful for them because they blow up assassin skin customization. The creepers drop the uh, 
the customization. There's also a jumbo creeper, I'm quite sure. They don't always drop it, as you just noticed. They're not always dropping the customization. Just their uh, assassin customization again. That just blew up. What did that drop? Sometimes they can drop pretty decent weapons for your level, if you're not a really high level. More skin. And, uh, and the assassin head customization. Might as well pick that weapon up too. Shooting the blocks does absolutely nothing. And, uh, yeah, so basically that's pretty much the gist of it. And basically with the, uh, with the skins, if you just, uh, come down here, you can, uh, pretty much just activate it by just pressing A on the customization. Skins, yep. So I'm just gonna... I, I'm yeah. See, it says already unlocked because I've already unlocked the assassin skin. I'm pretty sure it's dependent on what you actually are playing as at the moment. So, say I was commando, I'm pretty sure I would get majority of the unlockables as commando things. You can get different ones. I did uh, yesterday. I got a gunzerker one while playing as the assassin, and there's nothing behind here. So that was just a complete waste. So I'll, I'll quickly skip over to. Actu the actual customization, so you can see the, sk the Minecraft skins for the Assassin, and... Right here, guys, so here we are. I made my way to the southern shelf, uh, quick change thingy, and uh, so I'll just quickly show you what, it, what the uh, Minecraft skin looks like for the Assassin. It doesn't look too good, in my personal opinion. Could have made it look a little bit better, but I guess they were trying to make keep the Assassin look, but and then at the same time make it sort of look like Minecraft. If you were the uh, Gunzerker or the Commando, I'm sure it would look a, a lot better. So I'll just quickly apply that. And then they give you similar colors to the Minecraft skin. And by changing your actual like actual clothes itself, it changes the color of the helmet too. Or like the hair or depending on who, you, who you're playing as. So with the uh, Commando, it actually looks a lot more like Steve than mine does at the moment. <laughs> So, uh, we'll just put that on, and, um, yeah, so that's what the assassin looks like as Minecraft. So, don't forget to drop a like on this video, guys, and, uh, yeah, cheers.